Hey guys, Bobby Dutube here, and uh, this may not be a big Christian topic, but it's been a big topic for me pretty much my whole life. I've kind of been overweight since I've been a, a child, and uh, of course this is the heaviest I've, I've ever been. And you would get people to come up to you and say, wow, you got fat, wow, you gained a lot of weight, and uh, I think it's the funniest thing that someone can tell you. It's like, okay... I know that I'm fat. I know that I've gained weight. I know I got heavier than I was. I mean, how many times do I tell someone, really? Wow, you know, if you wouldn't have told me, I never would have known. Because I don't dress myself. Uh, I don't walk up the stairs. I don't have a mirror in my house. So I want to thank you very much for telling me that I've gained weight and got fat. And it's it's never someone uh, who really cares about you. It's always that guy who just just wants to be a bad guy, and just kind of a big mouth. And I, I'm not you know trying to be offensive to anyone, but it's the truth. Someone comes up to you and says, "Wow, you got fat. You gained a lot of weight." It's not because they love you. They just you know they're big mouths. Uh, because I'll tell you the truth. No one has ever told me that, and for me to go, hey. Those guys told me I gained a lot of weight. I better lose weight now. No. If you have a family member who loves you or a friend who loves you, and I'm talking to people who may have friends who uh, who are overweight, sit down and talk to them. Tell them, listen, you're my friend. I love you. You're my wife, your husband, or whatever it might be, my child. And tell them that, listen, we love you no matter what, but it may not be healthy. And uh, if anything, let's do it together. Let's eat a half a sandwich. You know, why don't we exercise? Why don't we start drinking water? And uh, when someone does that to you, 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 you feel you feel them. You feel you're loved. And you, you don't feel guilty or bad or, or uh, offended. And to me, that has worked many a times. I mean, of course, yeah, you got to want to do it yourself. And, and I thank God that I... I mean, I heard a message from, uh, from Joyce Myers. People want to talk about it, that's fine. I really don't care. And she talked about being an investor instead of a gambler. And... Uh, investing in your health instead of gambling uh, taking a chance on eating everything you want and think you might get a good result when you know eating better exercise and drinking water you know for a fact that's gonna work and that to me is life-changing and I can sit here and say that because the past couple of months I have been doing it and, and it's been great um, for the people out there who want to tell you you gain a lot of weight you're fat well you know what I know I know you're not surprising me. You're not telling me something that I didn't know. Don't go and tell someone that. Because it doesn't work. It hurts. It hurts. Because there's a lot of people who go through depression. There's a lot of people who go through hard times. And, and food is their comforter. And then you want to add injury to it. You want to add your, your you know, obnoxious opinion about it. It, it stinks. It's terrible. Uh, don't don't do that. It, it's it's terrible. I know that when people did it to me, it hurt. It never made me say, "Oh well, since he told me I gained a lot of weight, which I didn't know about, I'm going to lose weight." I mean, leave some comments the, the, for the for the heavy people out there. Tell me what you think. Have, has anyone ever told you, "Hey, you gained a lot of weight. You look really fat." Uh, has it ever worked for you? It never worked for me. Leave comments.